da 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 Yo-Kai Watch. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, we're continuing our let's play on Yo-Kai Watch 2 Psychic Specters. Last time, we completed Chapter 4, I believe. Or 3 or 4, I can't remember exactly which chapter. So, yeah. If it was Chapter 4 we completed last time, that means we're halfway through the game. Or dialogue. My apologies for making you wait a while. I ate. Alright, Yan. Now will you tell us more about this friend who needs our help? No. <laughs> yes. He's your grandfather. What? My grandfather? Correct, Nathaniel Adams. Hey, yeah, that's his name. How in the world do you know that? Why didn't you tell us earlier, Nan? But there's no way I can help him. My grandfather died a long time ago. Yeah, there's nothing we can do. Oh, you can help. If you come with me 60 years into the past, Nate... In the past? But how? This thing. <laughs> With this, a time stone. I can use it to turn back time until we arrive safely in our target area. Or, sorry, era. If this really works, we can definitely probably save your grandfather. Are you ready, Nate? Wait, what? Don't tell me you mean to leave right this minute. Come on, time stone. Bust a run to rewind time. Huzzah! Ah! Uh, whisper. Yeah, oof. Yup, ugh. Oof, bro. <laughs> put the stylus down. Where are we? Hmm. We're in Harrisville, 60 years ago. Oof, excuse me. We're not really 60 years in my past, are we? Oof, excuse me. Did we really just travel through time? I said, excuse me, you are flattening out my beautiful bulbous figure. If you meet Nathaniel, you'll know for sure that we've traveled to the past. It won't be hard to recognize him, he looks a lot like you. Nathaniel is probably at his house, so we, we should check there first. Let's go. We're just ignoring the fact I was nearly possibly permanently squished? <laughs> yep. Nathaniel, where are you? It's me, Hovering Yon. It would seem he isn't here. Where else might he be? Perhaps he's at his secret base. Secret base? It's our secret hideout in the forest nearby. I suggest we head there now. Just my glasses.
What's happening? That person has been inspirited by a wicked yokai. Hold on. Sorry guys, I had to quickly do something. What wicked yokai? What's that? <laughs> Next Stellan Spirit you Yeah, something jumped out. Huh? What what jumped out? My yokai watch isn't picking up anything. You can't see it. It's only the most hideous thing I've ever seen. It's a wicked yokai, an evil creature that gives normal yokai a bad name. We have spirit humans and manipulate them into doing evil and cause pure chaos. How terrifying! Oh no, he's giving us a stink eye. Yeah, it's coming this way! <laughs> Whisper! He's been inspirited. There's nothing I can do for him now. What? What do we do? Cutscene. Sorry guys, I guess I should turn up the game audio. What in the world just... Go! Oh! Just smacked him again, he went in for round two. Uh, I can't do him. I'll try. Get out of him! Wiki Yokai! Yaha! ha Yeah, yeah, yeah! Uh, he, ooh, ah! <sighs> All right, Mox, Moxie. Defeat the evils of the world with love, Moxie, and courage. I tried. Maximus Mass, the invincible champion. Oh. D yeah, what? Heroes <laughs> don't have time for a chit cat. Maximus away. My, there are ominous voices coming from a village. It's too dangerous to remain here. Let's hurry to the secret base. Ah, don't worry. It's some mobs getting ready to spawn because it's almost nighttime. The Ninja Forest. Ninja has leg butt. Oh. Oh my goodness, a bunch of creepy shit. It's like a monkey. <laughs> What is this place? This place Why is Crime Alley. It's a di these guys here? toxic disgrace. <laughs> oh, Red Outfit! You're the one who beat me senseless! If we stay here, we may get attacked again. It isn't that right, Nathaniel? Nathaniel, are you saying this boy is Nate's grandfather? 
Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure they copy and pasted the model, in fact. Whoa, it's just like Grandma said. Grandpa really is cool. Nathaniel, this is your grandson, Nate. Grandson? What are you talking about? Oh, wait. Grandson, what are you talking about? Hello, Nyan. Okay, I can't. Hello, Nyan. This... Please tell me you didn't use your wicked yokai stone. I did. I brought him back from 60 years in the future to help you. I never said I needed help. I can fight the wicked yokai by myself. But we came from the future because your friend hovering your... I don't have any friends. Havanyan, isn't your friend Nathaniel? No, he's not. Look, I have important business to take care of, so I'm out of here. And don't want, and I don't want to see you here when I get back. Grandpa, wait. Oh, shit just got dramatic. Yeah, he's gone. It doesn't take him long to leave us behind. It doesn't take him long to leave us behind. Even me, with my butler speed. Grandpa is really fast. Where could he have gone? He said he had important business, but... Perhaps he'll find a clue at his whereabouts in the secret base. Good thinking. <laughs> I don't have the ability to mind my own business. Large water pot. Homemade generator. Huh? Is that? Oh, it's a vintage hero, much like yours truly. Whoa. Whisper, you are not a hero. Nathaniel has a great deal of admiration for this hero, Moximus Mask. Wow! Defeat the evils of the world with love, moxie, and courage. Moximus Mask, invincible champion, defender of all. The world is my friend. Hey, that sounds kind of like what Nathaniel said when he saved us. Nathaniel loves to talk about Moximus. He seems to know all his catchphrases. Alright, that could be a possible hint. Yan, is this a yokai watch? Indeed, that notebook is full of Nathaniel's inventions and schematics. Nathaniel's the one who made the first yokai watch. What? No, no, no. Steve Jaws invented the first yokai watch. Whisper! Every yokai knows about Steve Jaws, creator of a legendary device. The one who made the first ever yokai watch long before that. Technically, I should say the one who will make it is Nathaniel. With a yokai watch Nathaniel makes, you'll be able to fight the wicked yokai. What do you mean? It seems Nathaniel's watch makes even wicked yokai visible. But since that function isn't needed in our time, it's been removed. It would be certainly be ideal if we could get Nathaniel to complete his work. Hmm. According to this note, he just needs pieces from three places. He lists timers and more, Mount Wildwood Shrine, and Springdale Ironworks. Ironworks, sorry. There. Alright, the order I would personally do it in, Springdale Ironworks, Mount Wildwood, 
and timers and more. So from easy, from hardest to easiest. With parts from both free locations, he'll be able to complete the yokai watch. Well, he's nearly finished. Let's go get the remaining parts. Yeah, and we might even run to the grandpa on the way. All three places are in Old Springdale. Old Springdale? Somehow I doubt the residents of this time call it that. Yes, well, we need to catch the stream steam train at Harrisville Station. Let's go! I'm excited to go to Old Springdale. Old Springdale has the best overworld theme out of all the all three of the mainline Yokai Watch games. So yeah. What's going on? Why is everyone so tired and slow and worn out? Uh, I... I didn't think we'd have to do so much walking. <sighs> it seems there isn't a bus to the station in this time. Harangyon, couldn't you have used the time storm to help a butler out? No, the time stone is for rewinding time, not transporting lazy yokai. It's literally in the name, you idiot. And besides, I don't have it anymore. I used the last one to bring you here. What? I was, what? Does that mean we're stuck in my grandpa's time? Yes. Don't worry. You're not trapped in this era, Nate. I don't... I know just the yokai who can help. Aha, uh -huh, right as if... Right, as if there's a yokai with such con such a convenient sci-fi worthy pow... There is! He's just not even gonna humor whisper. If memory serves, he likes to relax right around here. You can use your yokai watch to help Find me, find him, Nate. Where's the oh, okay? I just completed the hardest challenge in the Yokai Watch series. Reveal! What can I do for you? Who needs a hug? It's been a while, Miradox. Havanyan, I haven't seen you around in forever. What have you been up to? So he's a friend of yours, Havanyan? Huh? Hey kid, you look a lot like Nathaniel. He's Nathaniel's grandson, and he needs your help to move through time. Grandson? Wow, he looks just like him, and of course, I'll help my new friend. Am I gonna put him on my team? I'm not sure. I'll take a look at what my team looks like. But I don't think he's gonna be necessary for the team. Maradox info was added to a medallion. Th 
The medal you got was sent to a medallion. Really? Really? Friend? Just like that? He's friendly. He'll open his heart to anyone who needs it. This is more of a time travel issue than I need a hug issue. Still, you can easily time travel now. Who doesn't need a friend like that? Excuse me. Tutorial crap. Yeah, I can talk to him to move between time. Oh, I skipped a little bit of dialogue. Who needs to worry about getting stuck here? So onward to Springdale. Bring me to Springdale. Oh, pfft. Oh, wait, he meant Springdale as in Springdale in the past. I'm a fucking brain dead moron. But at least you got to see how he works. Actually, I want to talk to that Mirapo over by the Ipo while I'm here. So, wake up the Mirapo. The. Don't need to talk to the iPo to see my team. I can just open my inventory. I do, however, need to we'll talk to iPo to recharge the Sultanates. See, Kamazan, Jibanyan, uh, Buchinyan, Mirapo, uh, Ruffrath, and Hungorg. Um, this is a pretty stacked team. I don't think I'm gonna put Miradox on this team. We'll catch the train to Old Springdale from here, but first let's chat. Huh? What is it, Whisper? Frankly, we need to talk about money. Unlike for us, 60 years in an extremely is an extremely long time for humans. Ow. Currencies change. Inflation happens. The value of a dollar changes. It's all very technical, but... You, I, uh, your ever-resourceful butler, have a plan. I've done something quite good to make it possible for you to shop in this era. Something quite good? Whisper, what is- what in the world did you do? Hmm. Come on, tell me, what did you do? Sorry, trade secret. Just enjoy your worry-free spending in both eras. Three dollars. I'm pretty sure it's still three dollars back in present day Springdale, isn't it? Or is it thirty dollars? Can't remember the exact price. Comment down below. Mm. One ball's brain nails theme kicks in. So this is what Springdale was like 60 years ago. It's totally different. Are you sure this is really Springdale? Now that we're here, we should review our mission, Nate. Nathaniel mentioned three places in this notebook. And if I recall, they are Palmers and Moore, Mount Wildwood Shrine, and the Springdale Iron Works. I'm so excited to see your yoke, the yoke I watched that Nathaniel is going to build. Yeah, it's a past version. It's like a past version of PC builds, except it goes on your wrist.
Well, do you know how what how many time paradoxes they would call just by existing in the past? See, I'm gonna go for the Ironworks part. You can do it in any order you'd like. I just go from toughest to easiest. I'm so tired. I don't want to work anymore. Heh. <laughs> Let's forget all about work today and go play instead. Something strange. Something strange is going on here. Let's investigate the area some more. Heh <laughs> heh. Huh? I feel like I've seen this old man somewhere before. It's Knickknack, the owner of a memory store, don't you remember? But we met him in our time, not in this one. Eh, if you done, if you're done, if you're looking for the yokai, I'm making the workers lazy, check inside. A yokai? If a yokai's involved, then we can't just leave it alone, can we? Alright, let's take a look inside. If you're going in, make this marble with- take this marble with you. Mysterious marble obtained. A marble? How come? It's an extraordinary item that reveals hidden things. If you look through it, I'm sure it'll come in handy for you there. In there. Take good care of it. Thank you? Nate doesn't know how to process that request. Whoa! What's with all this smoke? I can't see anything! Oh, hello. Tee hee hee. There she is, Nate! Time to use the yokai watch! Yeah! Huh? I can't see anything! Is someone there? <sighs> She's a wicked yokai, Nate. If the yokai watch can't pick her up, it's a y wicked. Hubbard Yon literally just explained that in Harrisville. You mean you can't see her? But th there's a yokai right there! I wonder if the yokai is watch is broken or something. Oh, maybe this is what Knickknack was talking about. Why not try using the marbles you got from Knickknack? Hmm, is it really gonna help? Hey there. Hello there. Ah, eek! I can see her! I'm bad. I mean, Smogmilla. I'm a yokai. Hey, hey, hey! Introducing the yokai we meet is my job, a big part of my job. Hee hee hee. My apologies, but I'm rather busy with my work right now. I have to make more smoke so I can manipulate humans after all. What? What are you talking about? So you're the one responsible for a construction worker's behavior? That's right. Nate, we have to stop Smogmella. Yeah. He he he. I'll wrap you in, up in smoke. Now this mission isn't as far, hard as much as it is a pain in the ass. So yeah, basically you have to play hide and seek with Smogmella. I have to look for rattling objects. I'll just pinpoint the locations um when I talk to her after I cut. Huh? The machine is moving on its own. That's suspicious. Use some marbles to investigate.
Is it Bad Smella? No, it's a box. Oh, wait, it is her. Oh, dear, you found me. Hee <laughs> hee. Here we go again. Right. See you guys on the next location. I instantly found her. Oh no, you found me. Both men in the sign was always apologizing. Doesn't that get old? I'll wrap you up in smoke. Um, yeah, I'll flash up in a picture of where you can find her. Her in this part. I found her. Her again. Eek, you found me. Eek, eek, eek. The Jizzle statue is he here. Here is always silent. It's so boring. Here we go again. I'll wrap you up in smoke. Flash up an image of where you can find her, her in this round. And I believe the last place you're gonna find her is in the center room again on the stage. Like, object. Oh dear, you found me. Smug Miller, there's nowhere left for you to hide. Hmm. I guess I am a little tired of you, our game. That means it's time for you to, for, time for your punishment. Well, that escalated quickly. Well, I'm not sure what the recommended level for this fight is. You Banyan, I'm going to charge your sultanate and oh no, she inspired Buchinyan, that's not good. Alright, that did a good chunk of health. Oh no. She has a very effective move against Yabanyan. Um I don't have any good food items. I should really buy the rice grow rice balls, I believe, like I didn't. Well, that's not fair. I'm just gonna say that. He's dodging his ultimate. Um, leaf rice ball on rough wrath. Come on, Irapo. Alright, defense down. That's okay for now. Come on, just smack him once and he's dead. You could just sneeze on him and he's dead. Yeah, there you go. Oh, I could have brought Kumazan out next to Hungorg. I didn't think about that. We beat up a yokai. And we're proud of it. Look, the smoke controlling the factory workers has completely vanished. Huh? What? What have I been? Smug Miller, you were inspirited by a wicked yokai. I'm glad things are back to normal, meow. As if they wouldn't put a meow joke net there. A wicked yokai inspiriting a normal one is no good. Remember, 
You get spirited by a wicked yokai. That's no good. We've got to defeat it. I don't know how to do this guy's voice. I'm just gonna bullshit one up instead. I shall defeat the wicked yokai. Gwah! <laughs> My lord! That's Arachnus. He's the general of the Bony Spirits Camp of Yokai Forces. General, Top Dog, VIP, alright! Nate, right? Nate, right? Looks like our Smogmella caused you a bit of trouble. As the head of the Bony Spirits, I apologize for this impoliteness. Let's return home, Smogmella. Yes, sir. Even though I was unspirited by Wicked Yokai, I truly am sorry. Whoa, that marble well, that knickknack gave us really came in handy, didn't it? Yeah, it's super weird that it makes the wicked yokai invisible, too. Visible, too. Wicked, sorry. Oh, wait. I wonder if this is what was used in the first prototype of a yokai lens. I'm positive it is. It must have been what Nathaniel was looking for. We found one of the parts we need. You did it, Nate. We did it. We did it. Yay. I don't need to finish that. Charmed. Oh, guys. Why isn't... Sorry, guys. I just have to bring it closer to focus. I'm sorry if most of the video was not focused. I am trying really hard to fix that problem. Tough bell or speed bell? Defense. <clears throat> Bounce, oh, and he died. That should have been a boo. Oh, wait. Uh, I'm trying to think. Oh, yeah. Quests. Next one I'm going to do is the Mount Wildwood Shrine part. Now, this one isn't tough from what I remember. I don't remember much about these earlier game missions. Actually, I shouldn't say earlier game. Chapter 5 is like the middle of the game. But yeah. I almost got hit by a car. Oh, yeah. If you see weird cuts in the video, that's just me trying to get my phone camera to focus. Okay, I like that remix of the Mount Wildwood theme. According to Nathaniel's notebook, 
The part you need for a yokai watch has got to be around here somewhere. <gasps> but there's nothing like that here. Hmm, I sense it. There's a yokai nearby. Nate, use your yokai watch to investigate. Comadero. Oh wait, I have commas on, on my team that's also following me. Hey, b hey younger brother. I think Kamazon's a younger one. Kamajiro, sorry. Oh, my swirls. Oh, my... Ugh, I can't do it. Oh, my swirls. Oh, oh, my swirls. You came in by a chance see... Can you by chance see me? Fuck, I'm just gonna use Kamazon's words. Yes, clear as day. Oh, my swirls. Hey, do you think... Do you know someone named Nathaniel? Has he been by here? Nathaniel. Hmm. I feel like maybe I know him, but I. But then again, maybe not. Ah, uh, now I remember. Er, in my brother's letter. I think my brother wrote the, that name in the letter he sent me earlier. Really? Can I see that letter? Sure. Hang on a minute. Er, uh, so... Do you have it? Oh, I can't find it. What? Oh no, I must have left it at the statue of a fox. Galeria Volo... Near Galeria Volobard, I think. Maybe I drunk it out of my hands while I was saying a prayer for my brother. You dropped it? Hmm, I'm sorry, but can I ask you to fetch it for me, please? I suppose we should help him. Let's go find his missing letter. Whisper's like, oh, I guess we'll help you. Yeah, okay. Yeah, and all of these tasks couldn't be contained within in one story mission instead of a key quest? Can I get out onto a road through here? I don't think so. Hey, wait, I know this. This is what will eventually become Triangle Park. Yeah, if you don't know, one of my favorite pastimes when I'm boarding you know, a Kai is figuring out what will become what in Old Springdale. Dang it. Nate nearly gets hit by a truck, but survives like an absolute chad. Okay, oh, he's trapped, okay. This is, uh, this area is obviously gonna become Chopper's Row. His puppy guarding the statue. I'm gonna run by, okay. Ah, there's something jammed inside there. Amazon's letter. That line could totally be taken out of context. Oh, this has got to be the letter that Kamajiro dropped. I, how did it get jammed in a statue by, by getting dropped? Let's go return this to him. He'll certainly be happy to see it. 
The problem is how do I get my tub tubble up uh I could just run for it. Is the chest worth it yet? Oh well, yeah, Tublapa isn't. I don't think the chest is close enough for Tublapa to see me, so. Protective charm obtained. So that's a bike shop that I just walked by, so that's gonna become Blossom Heights. And here is Uptown Springdale. I have figured out what the whole map is gonna become. Talk to the dog, I think he is. Oh, did you bring me the letter? Handed over Kamazan's letter. Oh, my world, this is it. This is my brother's letter. Thank you so very much. I'll make sure to be careful not to drop it again. No, will you tell us what's written in that letter? Sure. Sorry for the short letter. It's me, Kamazan. After leaving the country... Look, you don't have to read it from the beginning. Get to the important part. It, um, during his trip, Big Bro was helped by a human named Nathaniel. He promised to hand over that belt as a sign of gratitude at the shrine. So he writes that I should give it in his place if Nathaniel shows up. Wow, so he's was helping a yokai? Grandpa's really a nice guy. Komajiro, what's this bell thing your brother mentioned in the letter? He means a swirly bell. It's a bell that will start ringing when a yokai is near. Oh. That's the brr brr sound the yokai watch makes. When you're near every other tree. I see. This must be a part needed for the yokai radar. Oh, I know. Since y'all helped me out, I'll give y'all one too. That's what's inside the yokai watch. Yeah, I think most of this chapter is a huge what's inside video. Are you sure that's okay? What about Nathaniel? It's no problem. I've got more bells to go ahead and take this one. Thanks, Kamajiro. Pleasure's all mine. I want defense, but also give away spirit or defense, but give away. Oh, that's an easy one. Give away spirit. I mean, technically, it would be better to give a spirit item to Kamazon. Like, an item that would strengthen his spirit. I completed that mission without having to partake in violence. And I do that for the timers and more part.
Oh, I can't wait to unlock the bike later in the game. So don't say that's a spoiler, because it's a given in the Yokai Watch series that you're gonna unlock the bike later in the game. It's like saying that our sun is ri gonna rise in the morning. I'm gonna ignore this quarrel, I'm sure it'll fix itself. Oh no, really, that's a side quest. Oh, wait, Times and More looked wildly different. Oh, hello, and welcome to Timers and More. Mr. Goodsight, but aren't we supposed to be 60 years in the past? What's the matter? You look like you've seen a ghost. Perhaps he's an ancestor, maybe? Um, excuse me, sir. Do you know someone named Nathaniel? Nathaniel, nope. Never heard of him. I see. By the way, that's an interesting watch you're wearing, kid. You mean the Yokai watch? Yeah, yeah, the more I look at it, the more of a, my watchmaker's heart pounds. It's settled. I'm going to make a watch even more amazing than that one. It's no use. I'm not getting anywhere. What? It's no use. My own fire isn't enough. I need something to turn up the heat. Turn up the thermostat. At a time like this, there's only one thing for it. Hey kid, this must be a fate of some kind. Will you do me a favor? What kind of favor? I want you to find me a very hot pepper. Something that really gets my inner flame roaring. What enthusiasm. It would be too difficult to refuse him. Sure, he'll find one for you. Oh, thank you. You should know I have a deep love for heat. Peppers around here won't do. I already tried all the hottest peppers in town. Nothing does but trick. Hmm. He seems to be quite stubborn for someone asking a favor. It sounds like we won't find enough spice in any shop in Old Springdale. Hmm. What should we do? I've got it. I've got it. Nothing here is any good. How about Springdale now of our time? We might find a super spicy pepper in our time that isn't in, in, on the market here. Oh, good idea! You know, peppers are often used to make curry. It might be a good to it might be good to check the curry restaurant in downtown Springdale. And I'm gonna precisely do that. See you guys at the curry restaurant in Springdale. And that was my last time riding a train, unless the game bullshits up another excuse. Okay, um... I know the restaurants are closer, but I really need to go to the every mart. I only- I need to sell some stuff. I only have $7.96 in my name. And yes, riding the train is the same price in both times. The only difference in Old Springdale is that you have to pay each time, meanwhile in Modern Springdale you can pay for a day pass. Right.
And $20 should be enough for the rest of the game until I need to buy some stuff. Also, I'm not gonna use these buff weights. Mm. Buy some raw rice balls. I'll get 10. Alright. And we're headed to the restaurants. Hello? What? You're looking for a spicy pepper? Yes, you truly understand! To be frank, I'm a huge fan of extremely spicy things. That's why I'm working here. Anyway, I recommend this one. Give it a try. You'll be hooked in an instant. I don't like spicy food. If I ate that, I would instantly die. Hecapino. If you, yeah, you'll instantly wish you hadn't eaten it if you ate a pepper named that. Thank you. That seems like a really spicy pe pepper. Ugh. My mouth just hurts looking at it. Exactly. Oh, I skipped a little bit of dialogue. That's okay. I'm assuming you're selling curry. Yes. No, 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 I don't, I don't want to go on the train. I have a Mira puppy. I should heal my yokai. We got into a fight on the train. Get me on the train.
Did you find that incredibly spicy pepper? Hand it over, heck a pigio. I'm warning you, you're gonna die. This, this is, hmm. I can tell you it's spicy just by looking. But let's see how it tastes. Oh, this is it. This is the spiciness I was searching for. Whew. Both my tongue and my watchmaker's heart are burning so hot. Alright, wait there. I'm going to get to work right away. I've done it! Already? That was fast? Huh. That's the passion of a watchmaker's heart for you. More importantly, take a look at this work of art I've per poured my energy into. I call it the top-notch watch. Here, take it as a commemoration. Oh wait, that's the watch model. That's the base watch that Nathaniel used for a Model Zero. In fact, I have the Hasbro version version of it. I believe Douglas used it in the intro of my last video of Yokai Watch One. What? Are you sure? You worked so hard on it. I'm certain. It's thanks for lighting me up. Up oh, the fire, lighting the fire in my watcher's heart. Thank you. Because of you, I got the chance to do some good work today. Thank you so much, sir. Hmm. Hmm. You can really feel the strong passion coming from this watch. I've heard that objects that hold strong sentiments have a strange power. Perhaps Nathaniel has been searching for a watch like this. Why can't he just use any old watch? He must be planning to use this as the base to make the yokai watch. We found we found one of the parts parts we were looking for. Great work, Nate. Yeah, this one is totally meant to do first, but I did them from hard it's the easiest. All right, I'm going to return this pepper to you. It was so spicy. I don't want even want to look at anything spicy for a while. You got the hecapino back. Is it an item I can use in battle? Whisper, what should we do with this? Hold on to it for now, I guess. Comment down below, what can you do for Hecapino after Mr. Goodsight gives it back to you? Oh. Reverse sword. This sword strengthens the weak. D and E rank yokai only. I can give this to Jabanyan. I actually I can give this a Rough Wrath. Cause I believe Rough Wrath is E rank. Jabanyan re Whisper played an Uno reverse card and then Jabanyan played another Uno reverse card. We finally got all three parts needed for the completion of a yokai watch. Yeah, but we never did run into Grandpa Nathaniel. True. Without him, the yokai watch can't be completed. I've always wanted to say this, 
back to the secret lair. Bah, 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 bah. I'll just let you enjoy the rhythm of the Yokai Watch Old Springdale theme. How far am I into the chapter? Okay, I have two more parts of this chapter to complete the story set. The story section of my quest menu says. I wonder what the other part is. Let me watch rank D. Get me on the train. to Harrisville. Yes. Bring me straight to Harrisville. No questions asked. Oh, this song is still playing here. Grandpa? Stop calling me that! And I thought I told you not to hang around here! What? What is that you're holding? Show it to me! Hand it over, Hegapino. Oh, it's for Nathaniel. That looks like a pretty spicy pepper. Maybe I can use it. Eek! No, the stick! <laughs> That's the same stick he used to save us from that wicked yokai, right? So you can actually strike them with it? That's amazing! It only works on wicked yokai, and those inspirited by wicked yokai. It's one of Nathaniel's inventions. He coats it with the stick. coats the stick in peppers. No wonder it works so well. Are we gonna eat soon? <laughs> if I use a spicy pepper, I bet I can defeat even more wicked yokai. Nathaniel, what were you up to while we were away? Training deep in the forest. Which is why he hasn't wasn't at any of the places in his notebook. Notebook? Nate went, Nate went to gather to the materials you need. I never asked you to do that. I suppose you think I owe you now. Nathaniel, this is your destiny. Nate is your bold basher. Bold basher? There's no way. There's, there's no way. 
Bolt Basher is the only one Maximus relies on. He's the only supportive sidekick. He became he Maximus' sidekick after Maximus saved his life. Nathaniel's, Nathaniel, you saved Nate's life too. Which means... Okay, okay, I get it. Put everything you collected over here. I'm going to finish a yokai watch, bold basher. Excellent. Nathan excellent, Nathaniel. You can see how uh, a little friendship can help. Thanks so much, Grandpa. Stop calling me that. <laughs> Stop calling me that. Uh, I can't give him a voice. Wait, that was the end of a chapter? Wait. Alright. Well, guys, that was my video. Comment, subscribe, and stay fresh. Bye!